Hello guys, welcome back. I hope you're all doing it very, very well. I'm finally, oh fuck, I forgot I have to hold this. I recently saw a video by Lainey Ozark and her video was titled something like how to pack for your European summer. I'm kind of taking some inspiration from that and this is gonna be sort of a little capsule wardrobe slash outfit ideas for a European summer or just summer outfits in general. Hopefully you guys enjoy, get some inspiration, whatever, take something away from this and let's begin. I do just want to kind of preface with when I say European summer, I'm thinking of like lightweight clothes, linens, skirts, dresses, like, like sort of like a classier, like more upscale summer wardrobe or summer fashion than is typically seen in the US during the summer. But obviously Europe is a continent and not everyone's going to be wearing the exact same thing. So this is just kind of what I'm going to be wearing on my own European summer trip. So grain of salt, you know, but let's begin. This is one of my favorite outfits that I have ever worn, honestly. I got this skirt from eBay a couple months ago. It is in fact a skirt, so very practical. If you guys watched my previous video, you know that I've been really obsessed with skirts. And then this top, I found this thrifting in the Outer Banks for my birthday and it's stunning. It's just got this really cool like accordion style like pleating almost the colors are not something that i normally reach for but i think they work really well and just like it's a nice spring slash summer piece i think i'd probably wear sandals to sort of dress it up but i think sneakers could be practical as well so this is the same skirt and when i first bought it i definitely saw it more of like a statement piece but i found that's actually quite versatile so i'm definitely gonna pair it with this top as well i just thrifted this it's got like the three quarter sleeves which are kind of weird but they are mesh so that kind of like brings it up to like a cool shirt i think and i don't know i just think it's like a nice summer outfit that i'll be wearing i feel like this is the quintessential european summer look with the white linen pants and then some sort of like nice little tube top these pants are thrifted but they're by old navy and then this top is from ebay i can't remember the brand these pants also go with everything they're comfortable they're nice they've got pockets they're just like such a great wardrobe staple specifically for the summer because they're linen and lighter weight and if we're going out in the evening or just when it's a little bit cooler wait for me a cardigan i really like this one it's pretty holy so it's not gonna be like super super warm but it's just like a nice added layer and i don't know it also just adds add some extra dimension to your pieces and just to have like something as basic as this as a good layering piece i think is a really important step to creating like a capsule wardrobe if you're going on vacation and can't pack a ton which i can't i'll show you my bag actually I just bought this bag from REI the other day and it's like a duffel backpack, but I am gonna wear it on my back. So it's a 60 liter. So we're really, we're really hoping everything fits. These pinstripe pants are literally insane. My friend got them from like off the street in London for two pounds and they ended up not fitting her. So she gave them to me very grateful they're so cute this top i recently thrifted i'm not totally sure how this top is supposed to sit like i have fairly broad shoulders at this point but it doesn't really stay up that well so i think it's supposed to be off the shoulder which i kind of like better i also really like that it is longer because these pants have this weird like button-up situation that's just kind of like an unflattering waist i think like you can wear this anywhere and that's what's that's what's great about it skirts like this completely have my heart for the summer and spring i really just love the layered maxi full length fun skirts they're also pretty light too so you might have seen that i threw through this skirt a couple weeks ago and then my top is from ebay but it's by the brand no boundaries which i think is like a walmart brand so it's just like a basic bandeau top but great staple and again like throwing on that cardigan you've got a look and especially just like movement in the skirt is so nice like someone take me dancing you know actually i've been wanting to put this on some sort of platform but I so desperately want to be invited as everybody's plus one to any wedding ever, you know? Like, I'm just really in a craze where I'm like, I want to go to as many weddings as possible. So I wouldn't wear this skirt though, but just food for thought. One of my biggest realizations this year pertaining to fashion and my wardrobe is that comfort is paramount and ensuring that every piece that I own and wear not only is like physically comfortable but also I feel comfortable and confident in and I feel so good in this dress. I recently thrifted it. Look at the back. I love the halter detail. I love the length, the print, the pattern, the colors is all so 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 wonderful and I just cannot wait to go to dinner in this dress or go to the market in this dress and just like I don't know i love it i adore it while we're on the subject of dresses this is another one that i thrifted recently i really really like it i like the print i like the colors i'm like iffy on this like i don't even know what you call it like a bust band like right under the boobs for me throwing on a dress like this 
is pretty much the equivalent of like putting on pajamas but it looks so much more put together so i'll definitely be wearing this and again i like the way it flows i feel like it's just it's summery it's great can we get a little applause for this top i found it on vintage the other day and i think i paid less than 12 bucks for it total but oh my gosh isn't that absurd? I really like the triangle cut of the top and then the straps you can just tie in a little bow, which is nice because it's very adjustable. I'm considering doing a little dart right here just because they're like, it's kind of loose on the sides. But other than that, wonderful. These pants I've had for forever. I feel like you see them in every outfit video. They're thrifted, so stretchy. Like everything about them is just elastic. Nothing like after a big meal, not having to unzip your pants, you know? So I'm excited to wear this. I just love this dress. I just, it's so comfortable. I really, really like these side slits. I just think they're so much more practical than like a really high thigh slit. And the mock neck detail is really nice. Although with my hair at this length, I feel a little bit like a slam poet. Like I think potentially if I wear this dress, I need to wear my hair up to like, I don't know, just make it a little bit less, a little bit less artsy, disturbed artist kind of look, but this dress is awesome. When I looked at weather, it said it was gonna be between like high 50s to like low 70s, which I don't have a great concept of temperature, so I'm not sure if some of those outfits will be warm enough. I think so like during the day, but I feel like this is a good kind of warmer, but still like, appropriate for 60 degree weather outfit both pieces were thrifted and this was actually from a yard sale which is crazy because such a good find but now you guys know that i take a lot of pride in having the majority of my outfits be thrifted and just like i feel like this just goes to show that you can still have really unique and cool outfits while still making sustainable choices to do that and again these pieces could match with literally any of the pieces that i'm bringing so score I feel like you can always tell when it gets to like the end of my outfit videos that the wheels start falling off and I just run out of ideas. But these are two pieces I think I'm gonna be bringing just because they're versatile. Denim skirt, just a good basic. And then this top is really, really nice. Both are thrifted. I just feel like these could go with a lot of stuff. But I don't know if I like them together. I feel like it's a little bit boring. I decided I was going to honorable mention some pieces that are probably coming with me, but I didn't like plan specific outfits for. First up being this top. I just think it's really nice. It's the off the shoulder. That's why I think it's nice. There's not much else to it. A little ruffle here. It is a bit tight though. Like I don't, I don't need all my shirts to be skin tight, but it's cool and I'm probably going to bring it. This top, one of my only Depop buys, but a really good buy. Super cool. Mesh right here. I like it. And finally, this top. Again, it's really long, so I don't know exactly what pants I'm gonna wear with it. Am I out of focus? This is what it looks like. Ooh, just like cool lace and yeah, but the longer length, I don't know what to do with it. Like I feel like it needs a lower waisted pant or like bottoms, but I don't know what. Okay, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. This was fun and I usually am in a bad mood when I finish these videos, but as you can tell, I'm not. So I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video.